Amazon has been at the top of the e-commerce game for quite a while now. The company's unique ability to shift products from A to B by offering the best distribution service for an e-commerce platform really caught my eye. But how do they manage it? Amazon can do this through what I call Amazon's five pillars of distribution. Organization, efficiency, flexibility, control, and future awareness. Amazon can achieve organization of their distribution cycle via their fulfillment centers. Amazon stores all its products in warehouses known as fulfillment stores. They are a picture of efficiency. A computer tracks each item as it's delivered, unloaded onto a conveyor belt and shelved. When a customer places an order, employees known as pickers receive an alert telling them what to retrieve and where. Technically I'm a picker, so that basically means you just literally pick the item uh, from, the, from the pods and then you uh, put it into a, a tote there. The items are then boxed and sent out for same day delivery. Amazon's efficiency of delivery can be achieved by its subscription service of Amazon Prime. Amazon's same day delivery has changed consumer expectations. Customers can receive a product close to two hours from ordering. Amazon's recent efforts at expanding its distribution center network has mostly been geared towards entering new metropolitan areas and to be able to offer same day shipping. Allowing people in cities and metropolitan areas to avail to same day delivery and a multitude of products. It is likely at the moment they are making a loss on same day delivery, but that won't concern Amazon due to the amount of potential customers they can attract. Flexibility is integral for the success of the delivery of packages. Evidence of this is Amazon's delivery driver system, Amazon Flex. But Amazon told Vice News it leverages Flex in anticipation of Prime Day. It's Amazon's own version of Uber, but instead of taking someone from point A to point B, you take packages from a warehouse and deliver them along a predetermined route. Therefore, Amazon can bypass many restrictions that postal services and couriers face, i.e. public holidays, post on Sundays, etc. It's a win-win for all parties and allows Amazon to have delivery drivers without officially having them as an employee. Another key aspect of Amazon's distribution cycle is control. Amazon are able to control and manage the delivery of a package at every point of contact due to their enhanced use of technology. Evidence of this is Amazon's purchase of the Ring doorbell back in February 2018. Ring allows you to watch your home in 1080 HD video. See, hear, and speak to visitors from anywhere. Thanks, you can leave it at the door. For instant mobile alerts and two-way talk, you can answer the door from your smartphone, tablet, and PC, providing solutions for many of the typical problems associated with delivery. For example, package theft, signing for parcels, or not being able to be available at the time of delivery. Finally, Amazon's awareness of innovation and future-proofing for their distribution keeps them at the top. They are always innovating for the future. For example, Amazon are investing heavily into the development of their highly anticipated drone delivery system, Prime Air. Amazon Prime Air is a future delivery system that will get packages to customers in 30 minutes or less using small unmanned aerial vehicles. Currently, the product is in development and are waiting on the legal clearance for the large scale implementation of unmanned aerial vehicles. To conclude, with Amazon constantly adapting to consumer needs, they are making their subscription service of Amazon Prime a must-have. Offering such great delivery service then leads Amazon to becoming the one-stop shop for consumers to buy all their e-commerce goods. If you enjoyed, please leave a like, comment and subscribe.